Shopping for groceries has become more time consuming and stressful. That's why the company Simbi Robotics says their robot tally is now more popular than ever. The autonomous robot scans shelves with computer vision to know exactly what's in stock. Tally knows precisely where every product resides in the store. Uh, so that location data is valuable to both customers or shoppers that are coming into the environment to help find a product quickly, uh, as well as store associates to know rapidly where they should go to sort of restock you know, that sort of product. This type of data can be highly valuable to people like Instacart to help them pick you know, groceries faster. Tally is embedded with more than 20 sensors, including 2D ones and 3D ones like these. These are able to capture uh, images in low light and also depth perception to make sure products are in their proper place. What you're seeing here is Tally's 360 degree representation of the world around it. The autonomous robot utilizes machine learning technology to provide data to more than a dozen global retailers in six countries. That helps save customers wasted trips to the store, prevents employees from needlessly clogging aisles, and alerts stores when they need to reorder products. The retailers are seeing a unique opportunity for automation to add more resiliency to their supply chain. And I think many retail CIOs around the world are beginning to think about uh, how technology and better data can assist them in pandemics like COVID in the future. Other robotics companies are taking on the challenge of disinfecting workplaces. It's not enough to just wipe the surface. Literally, you have to keep the surface perfectly wet for almost 10 minutes. It's an impossible task that you're asking the housekeepers to do with standard disinfection wipes. Miller's company Xenix has a solution, a virus zapping robot called Lightstrike. We're actually 100% confident that Lightstrike will kill the SARS-CoV-2 coronavirus. It puts out broad spectrum, high intensity ultraviolet light. And basically that's going to lyse the cell of the pathogens, kill them so they can't reproduce. Xenix's business is up more than 600% since they started the coronavirus outbreak. While hospitals are the main customers, hotels, food processing plants, and the cruise industry are all showing more interest. Miller says they all share the same goal, making places safer so workers and customers feel confident about returning. Mark New, CGTN, San Francisco.